installation of the Venus X energy storage system. This video takes the installation of two battery modules as an example. Install the base. Put the base near the wall. Install the battery pack on the base. Remove the pre-installed bolts on both sides and install the connecting piece. Tighten the bolts. DIP switch setting. Take out the bolt on the maintenance port. Remove the protection plate and dial the DIP switch of the battery to the position of slave machine number one. At the same time, plug the RS485 network cable to RS485 to port. Cover the maintenance port and lock the bolts. Put the RS485 network cable on the right side of the battery. Install the second battery module. Install the battery pack on the top of the first battery module. Remove the pre-installed bolts on both sides. And install the connecting piece. Tighten the bolts. Put the RS-485 network cable on the left side of the battery. No DIP switch setting is required for default host machine. Install inverter cable. Plug the positive cable or the inverter to the positive interface and the negative cable to the negative interface. Place the CAN cable on the second battery. Neaten the cables. Install the inverter. Install the inverter on top of the second battery module. Remove the pre-installed bolts on both sides and install the connecting piece. Tighten the bolts. Communication cable connection. Plug the CAN cable into the converter CAN interface. And plug the RS-485 cable or the second battery module into the inverter RS-485 port. Plug the other end of the CAN cable to the second battery CAN port. And plug the RS-485 cable or the first battery module to RS-485 port of the second battery. Power cable connection. Connect the positive electrode of the battery in parallel with the positive parallel cable. And connect the negative electrode of the battery in parallel with the negative parallel cable. Connect the positive cable of the inverter to the positive port of the inverter battery. And connect the negative cable to the negative port of the battery. Install the data collector. Take all the pre-installed bolts in the position of the inverter. Connect the plug of the data collector with the data collector wire and tighten it. Then tighten the bolt. Screw the data collector antenna to the data collector. Install the battery cover plate. Take the battery cover plate and align the four notches on both sides with the position of the bolts and tighten the bolts. Wall mounting. Remove the screws on the right side of the inverter cabinet. Install the fixture piece. Tighten it with screws and fix it to the wall with the drill and expansion bolt. Same operation on the left side. External cable connection. The PV cable is connected to the PV panel input switch. The grid input wire is connected to the input end of the electricity switch box. The AC out output wire is connected to the load end of the household distribution box. Starting up the machine, the first step is to open the battery power button. The second step is to open the battery circuit breaker on the right side. And the third step is to open the inverter switch on the left side. Machine startup completed.